When I first found out Michael had muscular dystrophy, I pretty much shut down for a whole year. In school, where he would have trouble writing, so I would scribe for him. It would take me much longer than other students, and other times I wouldn't get my work done in class because I was behind. It was frustrating in, in a lot of ways because I knew he was doing the best he could with what he had. I think he's brilliant in many ways, and I wanted to have his papers reflect that, but he didn't have the tools to do it. I was feeling a little down and I thought, what could I lose? And When we first were introduced with Alltech, we met with Deb over there and she showed us some things that I really didn't realize existed. And they were real nice and supportive of my needs and they wanted to help me with my future. I've been able to relax and pay attention to the class without having to worry about if I'm going to be able to get all my work done in time. And it just reminds me of being, when he was back in high school, I felt like I had homework every day. It was my work as much as it was his work. So now it's like he's pretty much self-sufficient with what Alltech has done for him. He's been able to, he doesn't even ask for my help. <laughs> That's amazing. If it wasn't for Michael, I don't think I would have been the person I am today. It's a big part of who I am. Don't let someone take away your hope. Don't ever let anybody take away your hope because... That's the last thing you have. That's your last thing you hang on to.